I decided to do another unboxing video this week. This time it's from two different companies. The first one is from MT Pet Emporium. I ordered 100 Purcellio Lavis Dairy Cows. I found a company on usinvertebrateauctions.com. I'll post links in the description below for both. Everything went great with the transactions. I didn't have a single loss out of the hundred. She even notified me when my package was ready for pickup. I had checked it earlier that day, but it showed it wasn't available yet. And apparently she noticed that when it was before I did. If you watched our last unboxing video, I ordered 11 different species of isopods. Unfortunately, the company I ordered from was sold out of the dairy cows, so I found MT Pet Emporium and I'll eventually do an update on the isopod colonies once they start taking off. I first took interest in isopods because I wanted to set up my reptiles in bioactive enclosures and after finding out that there's so many different kinds, I've taken interest in keeping them both for bioactive setups but also as pets and I figured it'd be something cool to post on, the, on our Facebook page and to be able to make YouTube videos about. Our next unboxing is from Best Friend Feeders. Once again, the whole transaction went great and everything was packaged very well. I'll also post a link to them in the description below. I ordered Halloween Hissing Cockroaches. I received 40 adults along with a few babies that one of the females had on the way here. I've kept them bred a few different species of hissing cockroaches over the years. This is my first time owning the Halloween hissing cockroaches though. They're a species I've wanted to own for years. Every time I'd find some available I didn't have the money for them. Or if I did have the money to buy some nobody had any available. So I'm excited to finally get to work with them. I breed them for feeder roaches for some of the animals, and sometimes I'll sell them as pets. I've used Tizen cockroaches in the past for some of our outreach programs. Some, every now and then somebody will find them interesting or cool. Most of the time they lead to screams and chaos. More recently, I've been wanting to expand more into insects. I've always enjoyed going out and catching bugs as a kid and trying to learn as much as I can about them, the same as I've done with reptiles and other animals. So I decided to make the leap into buying some different insects and trying to get some colonies started. The plan is to incorporate them into some of the outreach work we do whenever we're able to start back with it. 
Right now I'm uncertain of when I'm going to actually be able to do outreach programs in person again. So my main focus is our YouTube channel. I'm currently working on a series that will focus on the different animals we keep. It will be posted every Monday and I'll still have another video out every Friday like I'm currently doing. In the comments below, let me know what your favorite insect species is and why it's your favorite species. If you don't like insects, comment below on why you don't like them. If you've enjoyed today's video, make sure you like and subscribe.